All right, so this is the uh, part of the solution for the stupendous styles challenge that uh, uh, involves the pickup date and time. As you can see here on the screenshot, we're going to need the logo again. We've already got a style for that. That should be easy. Looks like we're going to need um, we're going to need a uh, a row with two columns in it, and um, then we'll need that uh, the date picker and the time picker. That should be pretty easy. Let's go ahead and uh, actually I'll keep that open. Let's get rid of that. And so let's open up the schedule page. Uh, I think the very first thing we can agree on that we need to do is set the background equal to green. Okay, and so the next thing I'm going to do is actually go to the donut page. And I'm going to grab some of this stuff here, and I'll grab that. And I'm going to paste it in. Let's see how much did I grab. <laughs> okay, there we go. I sometimes forget what I copied and what I need to paste over. All right. Looks like we're going to need a back grid down there. Okay. Um, so uh, let's see what this looks like. Okay, pretty good start. And I think this was supposed to say pick up, right? And um, here we're going to have the uh, date picker. I think the date picker was on top, right? Let's look at this. Yeah, date picker, and then the next row will have the time picker. Pick up. Great. Pick up. Date picker. Um, uh, placeholder text? No? Okay. Well, I think that's all we're going to have to do there. Uh, Grid.row equals 1 and uh, grid.column equals 1. And then the time picker. Uh, time picker. Grid.row equals 2. Grid.column equals 1. There might be some margins, but you know, this is, I think, almost all we need. Uh, yeah, I'm not crazy about the date format. What what did we have here in the uh, selected date? Huh. Oh, you know what? I got the wrong date picker. This should be the calendar date picker. There we go. And uh, let's go ahead and set the foreground white, roll white while we're at it. And we'll do the same thing with the time picker. All right, that's a little more like it. There we go. Awesome. And uh, I think that's all we had to do for that. See, this one was simple. And most of it was just copy and paste, but um, there was a lot of functionality on that page. Okay, so let's, uh, without further ado, let's move on.